Thank you all very much. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Family Feud. I'm your man, Steve Harvey. Tonight, we have four remarkable guests, three presidents and some lady off the streets. Please give a warm welcome to our first team, Barack and Michelle Obama. Hey there, Steve. Good evening, Steve. What's up, people? And on the other side, we have Donald Trump and Joe Biden. Yo, 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 what is good, my man? Why are you acting weird, President Trump? Shit, because we brothers from another mother. No. Hello, dear Steve. Nice to see you again, President Biden. Let's get this game started. Remember, folks, the goal is to guess the most popular answers from our survey. Let's start with a regular round of questions. Barack Donald, please join me at the podium. All right, gentlemen, the top five answers are on the board. Here's the first question. Name a reason people stay up all night. Barack, you were quick on the buzzer. I'm going to say studying. Lame ass answer. Let's see if it's on the board. The fourth answer on the board. Great job, Barack. Donald, it's your turn. What's your answer? I'm going with partying. All right. Let's see if partying is up there. It is. Partying is the second best answer. Well done, Donald. Do you boys want to play or pass? We would like to play. All right, Joe Biden, current president. Is that correct? Um, yeah, I think so. Do you enjoy it? Do I enjoy what? Being president. Do you enjoy being the president of the United States? Who is the president? All right, never mind. Back to the game, Joe. Name a reason people stay up all night. Playing video games. Show me playing video games. Yes, that is the fifth answer. Back to you, Donald. Name a reason people stay up all night. No way. How could I have missed this? Making love. Whoa, show me making love. Wow, the number one answer. To win this round, Joe, give a reason people stay up all night. Um, how about watching TV? Show me watching TV. Incorrect. Two more chances to get it correct. Back to you, Donald. Name a reason people stay up all night. Well, because I am a billionaire and it takes drive and determination to be so successful like me, I will have to say working all night. Bro, shut up. All your businesses are fraud. Nope, and you can't prove it. Back to the game, gentlemen. Show me working all night. Ding, ding, ding. Joe and Donald, you boys are the winner of the first round. Let's have Joe and Michelle come to the podium to begin round two. Welcome, welcome. How are you folks doing? I am doing fantastic. How about you, darling? I'm doing much better now that I'm so close to you. Hey, Steve, back off my wife. Nah. Get my wife's name out your fucking mouth. Nah. All right, Michelle and Joe, here's the question. Name something you fill with air. Top four answers are on the board. Michelle, what's your answer? I'll say a person's lungs. Good choice. Let's see if lungs are on the board. Show me lungs. Well played, Michelle. Lungs is the fourth answer on the board. Joe, it's your turn. What's your answer? Oh, I know the sky. You fill the sky with air. Oh, boy, that's an interesting one. Let's see if the sky made the list. Tough luck, Joe. All right, Michelle, would you like to play or pass this round? We will play it. All right, then. We will start with you, Barack. Just a reminder, though, because the survey only has four answers on the board, if you get two X's, you will lose the game. Barack, name something you fill with air. Hmm, I will say a basketball. Of course, the black guy says basketball. Boy, shut the hell up. Donald, you better shut your damn mouth before I whoop your ass. Show me a basketball. (laughs) Correct. The second answer on the board, Michelle, name something you fill with air. I will go with Donald's head full of air. Oh, man, that's a good one. Show me an airhead. Oh, yikes. Sorry about that. You folks have one more chance. Barack, name something you fill with air. A pool float. Show me a pool float. Oh, no. Sorry, folks. You just lost the game. Shit. Well done, Joe and Donald. That wraps up our regular rounds. You all have given some fantastic answers. Now, let's move on to the fast money round. All right, Donald and Joe, you will both be playing fast money to add extra cash to your score. Who would like to go first? I will go first. Fantastic. Now, in this round, you'll have to give me the most popular answers within a time limit. Donald, you'll go first. I'll ask you five questions, and you have 20 seconds to answer each. Each response will be scored, and as a team, you will have to exceed 200 points. Are you ready? I'm ready, Steve. Let's go, Donnie. Let's put 20 seconds on the clock. Name some ingredients used to make a smoothie. Fruit. Name types of food often served with melted butter. Pancakes. Name some items people pack for the beach. Mexicans. Yo, what? Okay, name some items parents buy for their kids. Small loan of a million dollars. Name some of the body parts that can be missing from a pirate's body. 
Leg. Great job, Donald. In total, you got 100 points. Now it's Joe Biden's turn. You need to get a combined total of 200 points to win the Fast Money round. Joe, you only need to get 100 points. Are you ready, Joe? I'm ready, Steve. Let's put 20 seconds on the clock. Name some ingredients used to make a smoothie. Um, uh, ice. Name types of food often served with melted butter. Lobster. Name some items people pack for the beach. Um, beach chair. Okay, name some items parents buy for their kids. Toys, yay. Name some of the body parts that can be missing from a pirate's body. Um, uh, eyeball. All right, folks, that concludes our Fast Money round. Joe Biden scored an astounding 140 points, so Joe and Donald, you win $100,000. Congratulations. Hell yeah, Barack, you ain't shit, bro. Shut up. You don't even know what winning is anymore. I do, too. 50 bucks, I win next game show. What's the next one? I hear it is Who Wants to Be a Millionaire, episode two. Oh, you are on on like King Kong smoking a bong wearing a thong. Congratulations, Joe Biden and Donald Trump for winning Family Feud Episode 2, and a big thank you to all our contestants for being here with us. As always, if you enjoyed the episode, please show your support by dropping a like or comment and subscribe for more great content just like this. It's been a memorable episode of Family Feud. Join us next time for more exciting rounds and surprising answers. Good night, everybody. 